guys, I'm sitting here with one of Duet's puppies. We are doing our cream cheese finger activity today. We're up on a new space. We're a little unsure. Sorry, the video is a little late this week. We're actually going to be away, so there won't be any video next Monday, but we'll catch up with you towards the end of the week. So cream cheese fingers is a really good activity for them. Learning how to take little bites of something that's soft so they don't get too chompy. This is Duet's little split face boy. So he's black and white. And he's got a little split face. His little markings. He's got partial white face and a little half mask. Well, good afternoon, everybody. I'm sitting here with Duet's little red merle girl. We're doing a little cream cheese fingers. This is a little activity that I do with the puppies at this age um, so they can get used to taking treats from our hands without being really chompy. They have to kind of slurp it a little bit. She's happy. She's on a new surface that she's not used to, so she's doing very well with the distraction of cream cheese fingers. She's a real pretty girl. She's got beautiful markings, beautiful coat. Yeah, this is the little red merle girl. So I'm back again with one of Duet's little blue merle girls. She's a try. Oh, she likes the cream cheese. Her little tail is wagging. Oh, she's very, very interested in that. That's a good thing. Oh, she says yum, yum, yum. Very, very pretty girl, happy girl. A little bit smaller than the other two that we've had up here so far. A little bit lighter, a little bit more feminine. Good girl. Come on, everybody, see your pretty colors. I've unleashed the tail. Okay, 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 one more, one more, come on. Oh, good job. Look at that confidence. You good girl. Good job. Oh, very happy with cream cheese fingers. Loves cream cheese fingers. Up on a grooming table, new surface. Really doesn't care about anything about being up here. Sometimes puppies on a new surface or a table can be really nervous about, you know, the fall off or the, the height. Sometimes that kind of freaks them out a little bit, but when we try and introduce new activities, we always try and make it rewarding for them and give them a little distraction so they don't have to worry about it. This is Duet's little red merle boy. Oh, he's a happy dude. Look at that little tail. Let's go this way. Oh, there you go. Good boy. Good job. So this is Duet's little black and white girl. She's got real pretty markings. Nice thin blaze. Good girl. She's a little bit more nervous being up here. You can see by her body language, she's just kind of sitting down. She really doesn't, oh, there comes the confidence. That's what we're looking for. Good girl. All right, good job. Look at you. You're like a little champ. Good job. She's real, real pretty. She's gonna be a rough coat, really nice fluffy coat already. One more, have a little more, one more dab. A little dab will do ya. Nope, are you done? Oh, nope, we're definitely not done. Totally not done. Oh, hey, you totally took all my cream cheese. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, I had a big glob on my fingers. Here you go. This puppy is very, very confident. Good boy, nice and easy. Little red merle boy. Really very striking markings. He's got two blue eyes. I'm not sure if you can tell that by the video. His little tail is just going a million miles an hour. Really pretty markings on him. Good boy. Where you go? Oh, don't knock over the camera. Don't knock over the camera. Here we are. There we go. Good boy. Beautiful, beautiful coat on him. And he's a try. So he's got brown markings or tan points as we call them. Good boy. Come on, step up. 
you go. Good job. This is one of Juliet's little blue Merle girls. She's actually a tri as well. You can see some of those tri markings on her. So a little light tan. She's a little unsure of herself up here. Totally normal, totally to be expected. New space, new footing. Starting to look over the side of the table saying, whoa, that's a big space over there. Good girl. I don't know if you can see her tail, but it's wagging. So that's always good sign of confidence. Good job. Good girl. Let's show everybody your pretty coat. Beautiful markings. This gray will really start to roll in here. She's a little bit older. Real, real pretty girl. Very, very sweet. Come on, take that. Good job. This is one of Duet's little black and white girls. Very traditionally marked border collie, wide blaze, full collar. Nice white front legs, big white chest. Good job. Although she's sitting, look at that tail. It's going, I should put a feather duster on that. I'd probably get some cleaning done in my house. So I have to do is walk around with some cream cheese fingers and let her dust everything. Very, very sweet puppy. Good girl, she's leaning on me. She's just still trying to figure it out. She knows that she's on a table. Let's show everybody your pretty collar. So you can see there's a nice full collar there. That tail just keeps going. White tip on her tail. Markings are very, very, very symmetrical. Very pretty puppy. Whoop, careful. See that, well, that was a scary thing. There you go, oh, there you go. Good job. Yay, good girl. duet puppy. This is a red merle boy. Oh, he is very curious about the table. Very, very confident. Um, he's a really good sign. And he's just like ready to go, ready to be on the move. Nothing really phased him. What a good boy. Tail going a million miles an hour. Beautiful, beautiful boy. Um, his eyes are probably going to wind up being brown or hazel. Look at his pretty collars. You go come on oh good boy good boy very pretty so remember guys i won't be around um next monday so there won't be a video probably the next video we do is going to be temperament testing so we'll look forward to that and getting some pictures up for you guys so thanks for watching and uh we'll catch you towards the end of next week take care guys